It's not at all easy to fool someone with a magic act, and the task becomes almost impossible when you have the famous magician duo Penn and Teller staring at your act the whole time around. But still, there are few magicians who have managed to do the unthinkable. So be it the incredible card in a can trick, or the amazing shrinking a girl illusion, hello and welcome back. And today, we'll figure out the secrets behind Penn and Teller's most famous magic tricks. The third trick, shrinking a girl illusion. Now the trick you've all been waiting for. The magician named Jean-Pierre Parent performed a trick on the Penn and Teller show and successfully managed to fool the world-famous duo. Here's what they did. Jean-Pierre brings a huge prop on stage, and instead of bringing an assistant, he calls upon Allison, the show's anchor, to be his assistant for the trick. Using that large contraption, he then creates the illusion of Allison's body being compressed into an increasingly shrinking box, the height of a carry-on luggage. He even goes beneath the shrunken box to convince everyone that there's nothing suspicious in the act. So, how did he shrink her body to that minuscule height? Well, before revealing the secret, if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you get instant notifications of our new video uploads. Now let's quickly see how the illusion works. In order to do this illusion, it's obvious that Allison is also in on this trick and didn't only have to play along, but actively create the illusion. If you look at the contraption, there's a tall board placed at the back it's actually a black piece of fabric which could easily be bent into the hidden space behind. Yes, there is some hidden space behind the box which can easily fit Allison's butt and thighs. The audience couldn't figure this out as it was disguised as wheels on both sides of the contraption to control the shrinking height. Now once Allison goes inside the contraption, the magician covers her up with a pink fabric. Allison then gets into the hidden compartment by crouching down in a weird position, bending forwards. So her final resting position would look something like this. Also, these two frames of the contraption helped her to hide the shoulders. But some of you would say, her knees are bent and it's impossible to point the feet forward in that unusual position. So how did she do it? Well, fake feet were used for this part of the trick and they were already hidden inside the contraption at the bottom behind these two feet holes. Now, soon after she steps inside the device, she pushes the fake feet to the front, which enables her real feet to stay in a relaxed position and point upwards all through the shrinking process. And this is how the magician creates the amazing shrinking illusion. So guys, hope you got the secrets behind Penn & Teller's most famous magic tricks. Which trick did you like the most? The soda can trick, the balloon trick, the prediction trick, or the shrinking illusion? And name any other magic trick you would like us to reveal. Tell us in the comments below. Preview.